Looking ahead to Fairfield, one loss, one win against them. What are your concerns going into that game? Well, they run an awful lot of sets, and they run them fast, and they run them well. You know, our ability to adjust to what they're doing in those sets and being able to contest shots. And on the other end, you know, they held us to 10 points and a half, so they play pretty good defense. Um, they're very tall and long. So that's a concern. You know, we'll have our hands full. We've had great games with them both games. We lost at the, you know, we missed the layup at the buzzer to, at our place, and we came back from 16 down at their place to win. So it should be a good matchup. Part of being on a good team is knowing each other, um, being able to read each other as teammates. How well would you say that this team knows each other at this point in the season? I think they know each other pretty well. They do a lot of stuff during the year together. And so I think they know each other pretty well. Maddie had to choose one food to eat for the rest of her life. I think she would choose stuffed mushrooms. <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> I would eat a ribeye. I'm obsessed with steak. What are you? I mean, it's a lot of options here. I mean, I don't know. I would say butter garlic pasta. <laughs> butter noodles. Right. Maddie's favorite TV show is Blue Mountain State. I don't, I've never heard of that TV show. <laughs> so, no, it's not. What is it? It is Keeping Up with the Kardashians. Oh, wow. I love Chloe. You're so, so basic. Funny. I would say Maggie's favorite practice trail during the season would be Oklahoma. Oklahoma? Oh, Oklahoma. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Maddie's type of shot to get. Um, the third thousand point was a layup, and then she missed it, and then she got fouled on the putback, and she made her free throws. That's right. What game did Nat have a career high in assists? That would have to be senior night against Iona. She had 11, Ooh. and she also had nine rebounds. Wow. Same as me. Maddie had 24 points the last time we played Fairfield, and they were all in the second half. She had five threes, and she just dominated the second half. Do you even know that? I think she knows more than I do. I have to say soccer. Dang, soccer. Yeah, all right. Yep, knew that one. The position she played, um, besides basketball, was in the sport of goalie. I mean, in the sport of soccer was goalie. <laughs> right, talk, it's goalie. Talk better. Okay. Oh, I know what the, I know what it is. And if you don't agree with me, you don't even know yourself. Um, cats move. In the post, she goes right, and then she like fakes back left, and she goes up right for a little hook thing. Yeah. That's what you do. Well, <laughs> I kind of like the jump shot to the middle, fade away. Well, that's, that's what I'm saying. Move. Nat's signature move on the court would have to be a Steve Nash layup. Yep. Hey, Steve Nash. Hey, Stevie. <laughs> Stevie. I have zero idea. I just joined Instagram, everyone. Just plays 25. Um, probably, realistically, like the Red Fox Network because <laughs> she watches every little spec she can, so. <laughs> All right, I would say she's correct if we were basing it off that, but I wrote Facebook. I would say Twitter. Twitter? Yeah. Twitter. Okay. Twitter. <laughs> if Maddie were to be on a magazine, I think she would be on Vogue. Wow, I was thinking about that, but you gotta stick with your roots, Sports Illustrated. No, but she always like goes like this, and so. What do I do? 